Hello, and welcome to yet another critically acclaimed episode of Ask Alpha Grooming Edition, where I answer your grooming-related questions so you don't have to ask your mom about man musk or your boys about bat wings. Let's get started. Today, we have two incredible questions, and I decided to combine them both in the same video because the treatment essentially is the same for both questions. Our first question comes to us from our friend Brian up in Boston, who wants to know how to treat his persistent case of swamp ass. For those of you not familiar, swamp ass is the technical term for when your butt crack gets overly moist and, as a result, pretty sweaty. Now, this generally happens for three specific reasons. Reason number one, it's hot outside. Side. Reason number two, you've got a big ass, leading to reason number three, excessive butt cheek friction. The result is swamp ass, an excessively moist and sweaty butt crack. Now you may be thinking to yourself, eh, so what? Who cares? I got a wet butt crack. Big deal. We all get them, we all got them. Well, I'm going to answer that question right now. You see, it doesn't take much moisture to seep through your undies and penetrate your pants, resulting in a swampy stripe of wetness. Picture it. You're sitting there in a chair. Maybe it's wood, maybe it's vinyl, maybe it's plastic. The fact is it's not fabric. You get up and you casually glance down at your seat, see if you dropped anything or your wallet fell out, and you see a moist outline of your butt and your butt crack. Sound familiar? Exactly. Swamp ass. The solution? It's simple. It's easy. It's something you used to do. Well, actually, technically, you used to have it done to you. Now, you probably don't remember this because if you did, you would have the best memory in the history of memories. When you were a baby, after you got done crapping your pants, your mom would clean you up and then she would take a little bit of baby powder and powder your cute little baby bottom. The result, you would stay clean, fresh, and more importantly, dry. Well, the same solution applies today, but today you're not a baby, you're a big boy, and a big boy requires a big boy powder. Now, I've tried just about every powder on the market. Some are good, some are bad, some clump and smell kinda nasty. My favorite is Super Powder by my boys over at the Grooming Lounge. It's a light, fresh, masculine talcum powder. This one smells the best, and it keeps me the driest the longest. You don't need much, all right? Sprinkle a little bit in your hand after you shower, all right? Then you drag it up your butt crack, all right? Get it all over, you're good. Boom, you're good all day long. The talc actually reduces friction, it absorbs wetness, and it prevents odor, which coincidentally brings us to question number two, alpha help! My balls smell, and it is totally ruining my game. Mm-hmm. I hear you, my musky friend. We've all been there, and you must have missed the video that I did talking about how to control testicle odor. But here are the cliff notes. All right, so where your testicles touch your legs, all up in there, it is hot. It is also dark, and it becomes moist and wet. It is wet, it is moist, it is dark. This is the trifecta for bacteria, which is actually causing odor. Now, I don't know much, but I do know that dry balls are fresh balls. So, same principle applies, guys. A little bit of talc, after shower, after you're nice and dry, fresh, clean, rub it down, sprinkle it, get it around, boom! You're dry, you're fresh, your balls are smelling great all day long. Super powder! <laughs> I've been using this on my testicles as well for the past two months and I really have fallen in love with this. It's the best bang for your buck and it's an amazing product. If you want to check out this product, there's a link down below to GroomingLounge.com. I've got so much powder on me after this video, I'm never gonna sweat again. Yeah, who's smelling good? This guy. Remember, gentlemen, if you've got a question, grooming related, that is burning inside of you, that you've been like tempted to go to your boys or maybe go to your dad or your weird Uncle Barry, don't. Why? Exactly. I'm your guy. They're gonna think you're super weird. Me, I think you're awesome. So remember, ask Alpha.